Queens home and friends. There was nobody in Garner I didn't know at one time. <laughs> Garner was small enough that you knew everybody. You knew everybody and everybody was your friend. In fact, we lived about six miles out of Garner. We, we lived on a farm. Then we had property in Garner. My mama didn't want me to ride the school bus, so she moved to Garner. <laughs> it didn't matter that I was a mile away and had to walk. But she didn't want me to ride on that school bus. She had a fear of it. And so, she, so we moved to Garner. So I ended up walking almost a mile to school. Good weather, bad weather, whatnot. <laughs> I, I wasn't like most children that, that disliked school. I enjoyed school. Yeah, that was my first grade right here on the corner. Miss Ethel Buffalo. I used to do, when I went to school, I used to do a lot of cartoons, you know. I could, I could quick sketch Andy Gump, Jigs, <laughs> all those things, you know. Popeye. I could, I could quick sketch them, you know. So, and then I, then I got into, started into the painting. But I've always, I've always liked drawing and sketching and painting. Oh, it was just a, it was a natural thing with me. I was, I didn't, I didn't need a lot of teaching. It was a natural thing to me. In fact, I've had some teachers come to me. <laughs> well, I'll tell you about the detail. Professionally, I was a retoucher, a photographic retoucher. And when you go into re uh, detail, that's it. <laughs> that's, that's the bottom thing in retouching. You've got to get detail. You've got to, you've got to see everything. It was correcting things on negatives and things. And not everybody could do it, but I could, op I could change eyes and retouch eyes, anything. And art comes, in, art comes into that a lot. I mean, you know, if you're a good retoucher, the art helps, you know, knowing what to do. I reckon my, my probably, uh, probably my favorite in all has been Dr. Buffalo. He delivered me. <laughs> he delivered me, then I painted a, a picture of him. I, I've always took my time, I can't tell you. I, can't, I couldn't even begin to tell you how long it took, took me. But some went faster than others. But I, I never hurried to do one, I always took my time. And, and I was independent, I took my time and I did what I wanted to do. Uh, I, I wouldn't know what to do without my, my children. They include me. They don't push mama off. They include me in things. All my grandchildren include me in things. So we're a real close family. I don't have any special memories about Garner, except I've always loved Garner. Everybody, anybody else could kick it that wanted to. I was always ready to come back. It's always been just home. I've, uh, I've been, a, I was away for a while during the war and things like that, but. It's just always been home. I came back. Just enjoy everything that comes along. Don't take it too serious. Don't take it, just, just, just enjoy it. I do.